it's spooky season, y'all, and you know what that means. We're gonna be building some DIY decorations around the house. All right, everyone, so welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you taking the time to watch this DIY video. A happy October, happy Halloween to all of you who celebrate. And uh, the agenda is we are going to be building some decorations for our pirate themed Halloween celebration. So a few years ago, Jessica and I participated in a community trunks or treats event and was unfortunately rained out. This year, we are going to be participating once again and we will be building most of our decorations. This piece here is going to be a rope wooden ladder for our skeleton to climb. All you have to do is measure out how wide you want those steps to be, uh, drill out some holes on each side, and make sure it's big enough for the rope to go through. And then at the very end, once you've got them all spaced out and you don't want them to slide up or down, just put a zip tie right underneath and it will not move. That will be stuck in place and you can position your skeleton however you want. Oh! Moving on to one of my favorite parts of the project, had a lot of fun, you know, figuring out how I could solve some of the problems that I ran into. I'm building a wooden treasure chest. As you can see here, I'm using a dog bowl <laughs> to shape out the sides and, um, you know, sand it down to make sure everything is smooth. Uh, I was pretty proud of uh, using that, you know, expert technique <laughs> to uh, get those shapes. Uh, just using some basic tools like a jigsaw, circular saw, and sander to get this uh, piece up to snuff. So that is one piece. Like I said, guys, the goal of this video was to uh, make the decorations out of reclaimed, recycled wood and uh, try to keep the costs down as much as we can. Uh, and I think it turned out pretty good. Uh, what we did here is just made sure all the um, joints were glued so that... Uh, it could set overnight and then after that we created the so other sides and the bottom of the box After that we went ahead and secured it with some additional 18 gauge nails one and three quarter inch long nails there We're doing the same method just glue and nails to make the top of the treasure chest box um, There we're using a little nail pop to make sure everything is flush and nothing is exposed and using a spacer here to make sure everything is uh, equally spaced out. Sanding to make sure everything is smooth and ready for staining, as you can see here, and just, you know, accessorizing as well. So the hinges were purchased at Lowe's. They were just, they were a couple bucks each, but the handles, we were just driving by one day and uh, actually someone was throwing away their dresser and these handles were originally silver and we went ahead and just spray painted them to fit the vibe and I think it really looks good, really adds a little pop of color. Here we're just building the mast for the sail and there's our little pirate guy. <laughs> and here's some details guys. Made the mast a little bit, you know, rough. And a quick build for the front of the ship and here's the final look. Hope you guys enjoyed the process. Jessica and I had a lot of fun building this and it was a hit at our trunks retreats. So guys, I appreciate you watching the video. Appreciate you checking it out. You know, feel free to leave a like, subscribe and comment on the video and we will see you in the next one. Peace.